SOLIDWORKS makes it easy to create frames and structures with structural systems. 2022 is no exception, with enhancements to secondary members and the introduction of connection elements and more. Secondary members are defined using existing structural bodies. This vertical post will be carrying a heavy compressive and bending load and will need extra support. Creating multiple secondary members is fast in SOLIDWORKS 2022 now that you can select a point and multiple bodies. All corner treatments are just as intuitive to define as they have been in the past, giving you full control over the end result. Also new this year in SOLIDWORKS is the ability to define and insert connection elements. These are great for members that are designed to be bolted rather than welded. These legs require a base plate so that the cradle can be attached to the floor. Just select the member and the plate is automatically centered on the end. If a connection element doesn't meet the needs of your requirements, you can adjust them on the fly. These forklift lifting channels may need to be replaced if damaged, so a connection element is perfect for this situation. Defining the position of a connection element is easy. Simply select the faces of the members then use the convenient member planes, which reveal themselves automatically, to center the element. The connection element is smart and can cut predefined holes in your members you select. Gussets and end caps are now supported for structural members in SOLIDWORKS 2022 and are just as easy to define as before. Mirroring features and components is very common functionality. Now in SOLIDWORKS 2022, you can mirror across two planes or faces no longer will operations like this require two separate mirror features. SOLIDWORKS introduced the ability to create an edge flange on a circular edge of a non-planar base in 2021. This has been improved to allow you to edit the flange directly inside the property manager so that you can specify the exact flange length you want. Structure Systems is a powerful but flexible tool with these new enhancements to secondary members, connection elements, mirroring and sheet metal Creating frames and structures is now easier than ever. So in summary, we can see that secondary members has been improved, connection elements have been added, gussets and end caps are now supported in structural members, you can now mirror across two separate planes in the same feature, and in sheet metal, we can now edit flange profiles created on a circular edge of a non-planar base.